Hello students. Today we're gonna do Pascal's triangle. What is Pascal triangle? I put one. Then on a second row I put one one, and I add them. I write two, and then enclose this with one one. One plus two is three. Two plus one is three, and I cover this with one one and. This is how you keep on increasing the rows of a triangle. So, uh, can you can you now uh, make me do what is what is the next row? Yes, you write one, four, six, four, one. Okay, next is one, five, ten, ten, five, one, and so on. So. This Pascal triangle, with this Pascal triangle, you can you can solve many many identities, or you can remember many many identities of algebra and trigonometry and probability. Application of Pascal triangle. Say if I to open a plus b whole square, so the answer will be one time of a square. Then I'll reduce the power of a, and that power will be given to b a b plus b square you will not take in trust because many students they already know the formula for a plus b whole square but gradually when I'll, I'll take you to the other rows you'll be surprised and you'll be eager to understand the concept of Pascal triangle I am now taking you to a plus b the whole cube so this is a cube and I'm reducing the power this is a square b and giving that power to B, again reducing the power on A, and then finally it is B cube. Now you will say, wow, and now the major application is coming because less people remember A plus B raised to power 4 and 5 and so on. So A plus B raised to power 4 is, yeah, say with me, A to the power 4 plus 4 times of A cube B plus so six times of a square b square four times of a b cubed and then finally b to the power four and one project is for you what is a plus b raised to power five that is a to the power five plus five times of a to the power four into b then i'm increasing the power reducing the powers on a ten times of a cube b square plus ten times of a square b cube plus 5 times of a b to the power 4 and finally b to the power 5 and this is how you can you can write any any binomial expansion also when someone has to open a minus b whole cube or a minus b whole square the process is very simple put alternate signs starting with positive and then put negative and then positive and so on like if I had to open a minus b whole square, so what I'll do, I'll be, I'll, I'll put a square, then minus b square plus uh, uh, a square minus two a b plus a b square. If I had to open a minus b the whole cube, my formula will be plus of a cube minus times of three a square b plus times of three a b square, and finally minus a b cube. So can uh, can we make it together raised to power 4 minus a minus b raised to power 4? You're right, it is a to the power 4 minus times of a cube b plus times uh, plus 6 times of a square b square minus 4 times of a b cubed and finally b to the power 4. And once again a project for you, a tiny project for you, a minus b raised to power 5. So a to the power 5 minus 5 times of a to the power 4 b plus 10 times of a cube b square minus so 10 times of a squared b cube plus so a b to the power 4 and finally minus b to the power 5 and so on. It's so easy and simple. Thanks to Pascal and Pascal Triangle. Bye bye.